Okay. Hey guys, what is up, Master Choose here, and welcome back to the Captain America Shield. This is episode six, I want to say. I'm not very sure. Probably seven. Um, I don't know. So it's been a while actually. So yeah, um, we have our finished shield product, the um painted one. And then you're gonna need some cardboard. And that cardboard is gonna be cut open. This is from one of those chip boxes that my grandmother uses. It's just a little cut out. I just made a really bad sketch of it and cut it out. And then using some other poster board, I made some and put it like that. So yeah, um, it doesn't cover the entire thing. That's one problem. It doesn't cover the entire thing. So we're gonna wrap that excess in duct tape. So yeah, as soon as I get that done, um, we're gonna attach it to that. But the, the poster board is supposed to be on top of that. If you don't want to use poster board, you don't have to. You can just use duct tape and you can just tape it to the back of this by rolling it up um, and then just smacking it onto it, or you can use glue, but for this, we're going to use tape. So yeah, I'll be right back. We're going to wrap this around with duct tape, and we're going to stick it on the shield. So, be right back. As soon as that's done, um, you just do that, and... So I have the shield. Um, if I move it over, all I have to do is open it up, and then we got the back of the little piece. So I did use duct tape, it was a little too big, so I had to cut it, and this piece is actually going to be where your arm is, and this piece is actually going to be where it's attached to it. So you're going to have to turn it to the point where nothing is showing, which is what I'm doing right now, I'm spreading it out a bit, and if there's too much showing, you can just cut it like I'm going to do, because I got a little bit of stuff that I don't need showing. So I'm going to put a little bit of duct tape right in the middle of the star, here, 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 and here, so yeah, that's where I'm going to put the duct tape. And this is what it looks like on the back of the shield. It's just paper, so yeah. You're not going to expect a lot. And we're going to use the deck tape one more time. And then I'm going to continue by pausing this. And as soon as that's done, uh, we're going to continue the video. So now we have everything um, taped. We're going to do this again. We're going to line it up. And then if there's any excess stuff we don't need, we're just going to cut it off. So yeah. Sounds like a, like a circumcision going to go on here. Um, so we got a little bit of excess stuff, but we got a little bit of duct tape we can put here in this area. But otherwise, it's a decent shield. It's hard, too. So I can use this in Nerf Wars. And it is big! It is really big. It is bigger than my forearm, so that's, that's the kind of shield I was looking for, actually. A really big shield that would protect me in a lot of stuff. So, uh, let's continue. By, I'm gonna keep trimming this thing. And... I just gotta fix that a little bit. But now we're gonna work on the arms. So I gotta switch the little duct tape thing that's holding this, and we're gonna use, switch it out to the silver duct tape that's right there. And then when I'm done using that, we're gonna switch it back to this. So yeah, give me a second. This is what the camera is resting, my phone is resting on the entire time. So yeah, this is actually a different type of duct tape that it's kind of like a bleach, it's a bleach like thing that if you peel it, it'll. Some will tear off. It's kind of like paint, basically. It's paint tape. How about we just say that? Paint tape. Now, this is going to be like um, um, Chris Evans in the movie. So, Chris Evans' shield had this really cool kind of X shape on the back. Like, one, two, three, four. And that's what, I'm really go that's what I really want to do right now. Because that would look really awesome. And they don't have to be the same length or a good shape. They just have to be able to look as if they're going to hold the straps. And we're going to do this one layer to find out where we're going to put them. And then the second layer will have duct tape wrapping around the straps. And then the layer above that will have these on top of that. So yeah, we're going to have a pretty sick shield. So yeah, let me pause this and we'll continue working on it. Be right back. So we have the four we have, I mean that we need, not have, gosh, kind of losing it, I've been in here for like three hours now. Having that, we can take, um, we can take some copy paper, regular computer paper, that some so a lot of people call it copy paper, I call it computer paper, and we're going to fold it in half twice, so it's like that. Then take some silver duct tape, wrap it around it, and then 
put it right here. Now, if you want to cut it, you can, but either way, it's going to be like that. And to round it out, go to a table and just rub it on the edge like this. And rub it like that. So, hold on the edge, like with a hand, one hand down here and then one hand right here, and just rub it down the edge. Basically, sand it. And there you got your bent paper. Now the next thing you can do is you can just fold the edges up just a teeny weeny bit, about half an inch. And once you do that, you take the extra duct tape that you have, like part of the roll or regular tape, and stick it right here. Using this, you'll be able to, this is going to be for my arm piece, I'm sliding in, we got my piece of my arm, and then using that, I can just tape it down with this tape, rather than a duct tape, on both sides, and voila, you got it. So, I'll do that real quick. And as soon as you get those two straps on, you have your shield. So yeah, this is immense compared to my arm. It is actually bigger than my front arm. And yeah, so I'll have a little recording come on where I'm holding the shield. And you can see it like protect my entire body. So yeah, that is the end of the shield tutorial. You're welcome, guys. I got a couple requests um, from like the 12 and a lot of other people. Because when they first saw the Winter Soldier Shield, they're like, oh my god, do a tutorial. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. But for that, I had a Target I bought for 50 cents at Washington Sports Club, which is a private club. You're not going to be able to get in. Trust me, you're not, unless you are a club member already. And then I used construction paper and some tape. But even though I didn't have a Target, I was still able to make the shield. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching this little serial. Bye, guys.